It's Care Providers of Minnesota's The Inside Scoop. With your advocacy team, Toby Pearson, Nicole Matson, Todd Bergstrom, and Patty Cullen. This week's host, Toby Pearson. Welcome to today's Inside Scoop, Friday the 13th of May. Only 10 days left in the legislative session this year, and things are starting to move along. First thing I want to bring to your attention, if you have not looked at Todd's articles regarding the two things they passed earlier this session, unemployment insurance and essential worker bonuses. Things you have to know are in those articles. They're actually moving pretty quickly on the implementation of those. So look at those articles to learn what you need to know. Second thing, thank you to everybody who made a call to the governor's office starting Monday this week because it had a great effect. We got some attention. We got requests for meetings from the governor's staff. Uh, we are getting our message through and we think we're making some headway as we end, move towards the end of session. Third thing, conference committee time, otherwise known as hurry up and wait. Yes, they are meeting and yes, I don't know if we'd call it progress, but they are meeting. Uh, this week we had great testimony from Nicole and then one of our members, Tim. Uh, they did a great job explaining to the conference committee that we are near collapse based on our recent survey results, that our workforce is key, that we need to have the state invest in our workforce with us, and that that will be the key to providing access in the future. So thanks again, Tim, for showing up and telling your story, and great job, Nicole. It was well received, and in fact, we are getting more press attention after being drowned out by last week's Supreme Court ruling. This week, tune in to Almanac to see Patty on the camera. Next week, we will be rolling towards the end. Uh, our goal is, again, if there is going to be a bill that gets signed, we want to be in it with some investments into our workforce. Things are looking more optimistic for us, but our work is a long way from done because they do not have to get anything done. They may want to, but will the price be too high for folks to agree on? We will be there at the Capitol advocating for you. Uh, so pay attention and next week, hopefully I'll have even better news on the inside scoop. Next week, look for emails from us starting in the beginning of the week. We are going to target the leadership. That means we are going to be targeting Melissa Hortman, the Speaker of the House, the Senate Majority Leader, Jeremy Miller, the Senate Finance Committee, Julie Rosen, and the House Majority Leader, Ryan Winkler. Trying to get our message across about the need for investment this year. Again, goal. If there's going to be a bill signed this year, we need to be in it. Lastly, kudos to our CEO, Patty Cullen. This week, she went to Chicago to receive a much deserved honor from the Knights. Thank you for your leadership, Ms. Cullen, and all you do for all of our members. So if you are a member, don't forget to send her an email and say, hey, congratulations, Patty, on your award from McKnight's. And that is this week's Inside Scoop.